Welcome back to McKenzie and Company. Today, I will be going after Derek the baseball player. Well, Brandon's adorable. Aaron's mellow, but I really like Derek. Oh, I like Derek too. He's the man on the yellow CD. Looks like he has curly hair. This game was made in 1995, so the CD containers are sort of falling apart at this point. The Derek CD just sort of fell in half. I, I mean, not the CD, but the CD case. The CD is fine. I, I will be able to play. Right? Game? You're gonna let me play, right? The CD's okay? Good, it's okay. So this is the big baseball game, and our team is losing. That's because Derek's not playing. Remember the opening scene? Derek's arm is injured. Man, I can't believe we're losing the state finals! They're losing 16 to 3 in the bottom of the fourth? What? Uh, for those of you who don't speak baseball, the game isn't even halfway over yet. And I'm hungry. Hey, how about a stupid chili crowd dog? I got cheese whiz. Uh. You know cheese whiz? Oh? Uh, hey. Uh, ew! Ew! Oh, man! Oh, no, I'm not very hungry anymore. Is that a girl, Charlie? Hey, it's too bad they're losing you. They sure could use Derek today. <laughs> okay, I said I wasn't hungry, but I still ate a hot dog. Let's go to right field. This is the photographer girl, Lila? I've noticed a pattern with this game. Every, every single storyline has two weird characters, and before you can go to prom, those two weird characters need to start dating. So I presume this is our weird female character. How about this one? What? Uh, apparently, we need to set her up with the band teacher. Oh, geez, that's strange. Okay, but this is the last one. Good. Yeah. Whoa, that's Aaron. Oh my gosh, it's him. Oh, Sam, he's leaving. Wait, is Weird Girl trying to move in on my man? Because I'm the one who gets to date Derek in this storyline. I'm gonna save my game here. Game saved. Uh, just based on prior experience, I'm going to assume Alex is a complete moron. Can I have a bite of your hot dog? Do you want a bite of my hot dog? It's so gross. Yeah, bad idea, Alex. Completely out of your mind? You listen to the urchin over us? Carl, Alex still eats dirt. Yeah, yeah, that that was basically a humongous failure. You picked Derek for a reason. Be true to your heart. No, the best things in life aren't always. I'm going to tough, tough dude. 
not go shopping. Wait. Are we going to shop? No, I don't want to shop. I want to actually uh, talk to Derek. So what should I ask him? I I think I'll ask about his arm. I'll say, oh, I'm sorry, your arm is hurt. That's nice, right? I heard what happened. I'm really sorry. How's it feel? It's pretty humbling. I think my ego has rigor mortis. No, oh, you're being funny. Well, not really, but you're trying. <laughs> it's amazing how you always keep your sense of humor no matter what. You know what happened? Uh, I don't know everything. What did happen? Well, not all the gory details, but yeah, everybody's talking about it. The whole school? This is my worst nightmare. I'm the laughing stock of Madison High. Now I really want to know how he broke his arm. D did he, like, dress up like a princess for his little sister's birthday party and broke his arm tripping over a stuffed animal? Oh, nobody thinks that. Everybody's really bummed out for you. That really means a lot to me. Thanks. Oh, hey, that's my ride. You're... Carly. Give me a break. We're in math together. You're terrible. Carly Adams, 555-1545. Whoa. Right. I'm Mary Nelson. Let's catch up. We do lunch. Carly just gave him her phone number. Carl, you are 100% pure smooth. So what are you going to do for now? Um, well, I'm just going to be myself because if I change into an outfit, I have to change CDs. Nothing special, just be myself. Good. I never let what Brian likes make me act fun. I mean, either he likes me for me, or I'm not interested. So, do you need any help here? Because otherwise, I got homework. Nah, I don't need help. I've got it covered. Well, don't worry. Everything will be fine with Derek. I know it. See you later. Bye, Sam. Okay, so, let's check my diary. I ate a hot dog. Not the best idea ever. Lila is the photography girl. Derek? Oh, and that's it. Hey girl, this is Trish. Thought Derek on my way home. <laughs> Very cute back pocket. This is Trish. <laughs> I got the car Monday, so call me when you're ready for school. Oh. Bye. Call Trish in order to skip ahead to the next part of the game. Car, it's Kim. You gotta let me know. <laughs> my mom told me today I have a book sale. Please, I need it Monday. Thanks. This is such a bad editing job. Oh my. Hi, Carly. This is Frank at Our Town Theater. The schedule's posted, so make sure you show up on time. People like to get their tickets before the show. Oh. Okay. I. Oh yeah, I'm a theater person. Hello, Carly. It's Mayor Wells. The lead in the spring play has the checkerbox. Do you think you could take her place? rehearsal is next Friday afternoon. Let me know as soon as possible. Thanks. Bye. Oh, okay. Well, we'll get the history book for our friend. And let's call the mayor. I can't see anything. Um, maybe the video disappeared. I'll say yes. I'll, I'll be in the play. I've been planning on it, Mayor Wells. Carly, that's great news. We'll see you after school then on Friday. Bye. Okay, and can I call the theater? No, no, I cannot. Sounds good. So, so that's the uh, beginning of the Aaron storyline. Wait, I have his number. Oh, but he's not picking up. Okay, well, that's the beginning of the Aaron storyline. In the next video, I'll call Trish and we'll go to school.